That safe couldn't be blown open with a bulldozer. And he hacked it. That ain't happening. Those safes have special time locks, special codes. Hey everybody, Larry Lawton here. I got a good video. Yes, I'm on a gaming kick because I'm loving gaming again. It's back and I'm waiting for GTA 6. I got a little teaser to tell you. I'm gonna be having Michael from GTA doing a video with him. Yes, Ned. I'm gonna be doing a video. I did one with uh, Solo, who is Franklin. I did one with Jay Kleitz, who is Lester, and I am doing Michael. So it's coming, and I just spoke to him actually today. Before I get started on that, please check us out on all the programs. Check us out on Discord. Thank you, Discord, again, for helping us with these videos and bringing them all to us. Check my book out, Gangster Redemption. Check out my cigars, The Crooked Diamond best cigar in the market. We're going to be in Germany soon. The cookbook. A very good update on the cookbook. It is coming, so don't think we've forgotten about you. We've been having some issues, but since I had Peter uh, Lopez on, the publisher, we're working a little bit quicker way. So things are coming, and now we're going to get going. Now, everybody, I am going to be reviewing the Pacific Standard Heist bank robbery in GTA 5. Yes, GTA 5. GTA 6 is coming soon. We know it. So I'm gonna have a lot of fun with that as well. I know you like the Payday 3 video. We're gonna be doing more of these because man, I get my blood pumping because I know I could do these things good and give you guys the right insight. Let's get rolling. Now, obviously, here's Lester. And again, I know him, his name is Jay Kleitz. But what is he doing? He's getting the crew together and they are coordinating. Not like Payday, they didn't see any of this. But again, I gotta go back to Lester. Lester, you don't belong being a boss acting like the way you are. You just don't. Sorry. You will do crowd control. The vault team will go downstairs, blow the first vault door with the thermal charges, then use the card to get into the network and open the second vault door. And then look out, because you'll have about two minutes before every- Okay, he coordinates this robbery right, but look at the people he's got doing it. They're all dressed differently. I know it's people in here, but you know, you wouldn't do that if you're coordinating a good robbery. You just wouldn't do that, people. You have to coordinate whether it's all dark or all well. You want to do that so you don't want to be spotted. You don't want to be picked out of the crowd. Uh, now they are actually uh, uh, dressed the right way. Okay, they switched it up. The Pacific Standard Heist, here we go. All right, they're all going their separate ways. They have their uh, marching orders from Lester. Listen, I know I'm gonna say it a lot here. Sorry, Lester. I should be the boss. Alright, here we go. Every one of these games do what I don't like, and that's the crazy driving. Alright, there you go. Went through a red light. Ticket number one. I should add him up. On the curb, almost spins out. Well, this is GTA at its best, people. Alright, they're running. They are hot already. Oh, look at this. Gets hit. He gets hit by his own guy. Not good. All right, they're walking in. Guns are blazing. One guy's the, uh, I guess, it's like the uh, butler. They're armed to the T, but nobody sees them. They lock in the door so nobody can get out. Pretty smart way. But those wire ties wouldn't hold people trying to get out. That's number one. They would have had to do that with chains. Uh, already they're thinking about taking kidnapping and uh, hostages. Listen to me, it's one of the big reasons I didn't go to jail for life. I was planning a heist and I didn't do it with uh, hostages. Now, they, they got this stuff that they actually can burn through metal. It's kind of like a, a magnesium or something that burns and it can burn and burn a lock right off. Never had to use any of that high tech stuff. That wasn't my gig. I was a strong arm guy. Now, obviously, the time it's taken them to do this, alarms have been hit. SWAT teams have been noti noticed, uh, notified, and they know already these are guys are well armed, and they know there's a lot of them. So, unless this guy's like the money heist, here they go in the same game, whacking people. There's the murder, murder charges. You know, I talked to a couple of fans today, and some of them said they don't like to do heists where they gotta kill people. They wanna do heists where they don't have to, it's harder. Look at the size of that safe, people. Now that safe, first of all, is gonna have a special time lock on it, and you don't just get through this safe. 
and, and he's moving. Now, these guys are setting up some more diamond. That safe couldn't be blown open with a bulldozer. And he hacked it. That ain't happening. Those safes have special time locks, special codes. You, nobody can just do that. Look at the thickness of that. Look at the thickness of that wall. In fact, I went to a restaurant with JD Delay, uh, and him and I went to a vault bank. There was a restaurant out. You see the thickness of that door if you haven't seen those pictures on Instagram. Now, you keep going through these gates. Okay, now how do you get into these safe deposits? But money is not going to be laying out like that. Not done. It's not that way. Money is not put in a vault like that. Money is logged and put in another box or a rolling safe. But it's not just thrown around that like it was, uh, nobody knows what's going on. But it is stashing a lot of stacks of hundreds. And you could put a lot of stocks of hundreds. If you notice the difference between this and one of my other videos, if you haven't seen Payday 3, go there, check it out, and comment. Because they didn't have any of this tech, tech stuff. The guy was going around grabbing jewelry, he only got $100,000, and he was there forever. You see how much money he was putting? That's cash, ladies and gentlemen. You know what they say, cash is king. I have a shirt like that. All right, now they're going. The only thing I don't see is you wouldn't be running around that easily with that kind of money. Money weighs, money is heavy. A bag like that's going to weigh about 70 pounds. And, and that's, I don't know if it's a girl or whatnot, but she's running around that like she's Hercules. The, all the ATM machines, they're not taking them. But he's got a bazooka. This guy's got a bazooka. These guys came on. Where did they bring all this stuff in? Here, look at the cops. Done. This reminds me of the LA, uh, LA thing, the bank robbery. I think that was in the 90s, early 90s, when they had the armor and all that, and they beat him. All right, now what's going to happen? They're armed better than the police. That's a fact. And not, you're not going to exit the bank just like this. Now, Obviously, I think they could have had a better way out of here. They could have put a helicopter on the roof. They could have did a lot of other things and divert them. I don't know what's going on in this bank robbery. But this is just a shoot em up robbery. Now, nobody's getting hit here. Look at how open they are. Come on. Either they're the worst shots in the world, the cops. Nobody's getting hit. But this girl can run with a lot of weight and money on her, can't she? Just whacking all these people. You know, I'm going to make a game where the cops are good. Or well, when I come out with my server, I'm going to ask for some sharpshooter cops. Because I know what time it is. Now, they're going down these hills. You know what these hills remind me of, people? L.A. or San Francisco. They got a lot of hills. This lady, this lady jumps around with that money like she's a, a gymnast. Helicopter above them. They're in trouble. Go back to the gateway. They're out of the area. How's that? Look, look. She's leaking money. Did you see that? Boy, that would piss me off. How, why would you have planned people with another car or something? Listen, like I said, as the biggest jewel robber in the United States, I had my getaway planned before I had the robbery planned. That means I knew exactly what getaway would, I'd be at if the cops were coming this way, if I saw something that was funny this way, if I thought I was spotted this way, where I could dump the car, where I could get to a new car. This was all planned. Obviously, they had something planned here. They got the motorcycles. But why did they just go to them? Obviously, with all splitting up on motorcycles, that is an actual smart move. Matter of fact, I was watching some uh, motorcycle uh, chase videos the other day, and uh, tough to stop when you got a group of motorcycles. Who do you chase? Now, I'm assuming they all got a bag like this, but this girl's got 70 pounds. Oh! Now, they got Lester in their ear. Now, the way Lester set this one up, if I got away with this one, I'd whack Lester. Again, not a slick getaway. You have to go to a helicopter. You have to go to a place where you can't be seen. Uh, obviously, look at this. Oh! Almost got him. I love the getaways. I love the driving in these games. This is my stuff. Now, I'd like to know if they... Sh they never show the uh, speed they're going. But look at this take, guys. Look in your right corner, 687000 That's a lot of cash. I would have to probably rob $2 million to get that kind of money uh, in, in actual cash. So that's a lot of jewels. But I could put $2 million in a briefcase smaller than the thing she has on her back. And I'm sure that's not all of the 687000 Because to put it all with one person is not a good move either. One guy gets caught, it's all for naught. Oh, how don't you go down by getting hit? And how does Lester 
know everything what's going on. I never used to get that. I asked Jay that too when he called me. He's a good guy actually. So is uh, Sean, which is uh, solo he goes by, and that's Franklin. Real good guys too. Michael too, I met him today. Now, you're out in the middle of nowhere. Where are you going? Who planned this Lester? Lester, I'm gonna get that petition going again because you gotta get out of here, Lester. If you plan the getaway out here, I'm waiting to see where the getaway goes to. But right now, Lester, I'm not impressed. You know, it kind of looks familiar, the roads and stuff. I don't know if I did, I didn't do this one. I'm sure I played it because I got, you know, playing GTA pretty good. Not like you guys, but pretty good. I just like to drive. Cop, cop cars never gonna cop, catch a motorcycle. That's number one. Oh, look at this. Ooh, nice. That's a good turn. Negotiated that turn well. I just don't know where they're going unless they have some back cave that I don't know about. I mean, you're going, this, you know what this is reminding me of? Pikes Peak. Pikes Peak, I think it's Colorado, and it's a mountain uh, that you go up, and they have races and stuff. Did she just throw the money at him? That was pretty wild. All right, now they're under some kind of uh, something. Now, again, this is where you have a, you know, some kind of bat cave or a cave to get. Nobody would know where you went. But no. Look at all these cops showing up from anywhere, man. I'll tell you what, these towns have a lot of cops. I tell you, man, look at this guy go through. This guy's got a dirt bike now. I do like about driving the GTA. Okay, where are all the other guys? Are they caught? Are they going to give each other up? That's another thing. You know, I didn't see it. I didn't see a few other things. They went in with all this arm and nobody disabled cameras. So everybody knows who this is. So this is not a stealth robbery, so to speak, like I did. Listen, when I did a robbery, I made sure they didn't know who I was. One cop wouldn't be there. They'd have multiple cops. They're not gonna have a roadblock with one cop. What is he gonna do? Obviously he's outgunned. They know they're outgunned. Come on, people. They know they're outgunned because they, they got blazing with guns and, and, and uh, grenades and everything else. Bazookas? Wow, look at this person, man. This guy can ride. Wow, look at this. This is a wild ride. This is a pike. Whoa, whoa, he got a parachute. Look, I guess they do. Look at this. Wow, pretty slick move there. Where's the money? I didn't see the money. How'd the money come out of there? Oh, wow, look at this getaway. All right, Lester, let me give you a little props there. That you threw me for a loop, but I don't see the money. And, you know, you could not let a parachute go off with all that money on your back. 70 pounds, no less. But look at this, now he's gonna hit a tree. What is he gonna do? Ooh, pretty good, pretty good. Okay, where's the money? You don't see the money, people, do you? I don't know what happened to the money, okay? That's just me. Now look, she's running. This is a pretty good looking athletic broad, I'll tell you that. She just keeps going. She, and she's got leather pants on. In the summer? I guess there's a motorcycle she get. So far, you can see the take is 687,500, and the time only four minutes. She's swimming in the leather pants, getting out to a dinghy, jumps out of a dinghy. That's harder than you think. You Listen, I'm retired Coast Guard. You don't just jump on a boat like that. You'd have to get on that boat from the rear. And look where she's going backwards. That's not happening that easy. Oh, but look at this, getting the next guy. Oh, he's got some money on him. All right, this guy, he's got a knapsack. Maybe he's got some money. So this was the rendezvous point. Okay, guys, I got it. Now, they're taking this boat. First of all, with all those cops, you would have had a helicopter up, and this would have planned, would have been dead in the water. But I still see five stars up there. I don't know if that means they're open or not. But he's shooting up a flare. Okay, they're coming to a slow. I love the way they do it. This is so real. You know, the graphics in GTA compared to Payday 3 people, I don't think you can compare, compare them. I really don't. Here's Lester. What cut do you think you're getting, Lester? Look at him. From the crippled guy to dancing around here like he's got all the money. Okay, let's look at this. 647,000 or something like that. How many ways you're putting it up? There's six of them? They're not even getting up. About a hundred grand a piece? Still more than the payday heist. And they whacked a lot more people in the payday heist and they would have had to get fences to get that. This Lester though, I want to slap the shit out of him. What is Lester, Lester on drugs or something? Ha ha That's Lester. Lester, I'm telling you Lester, let me in one of these games, I'm gonna slap the shit out of you, I'm taking over the crew. End of story. 
You can't act like that, Lester. You're not a criminal. They're looking at you like you got two heads. And they're also saying, why are we giving this guy any money? They're looking. Maybe they're going to do it now. You see? He's heavily medicated. Did I call it? Come on, people. It's what I do. The best. I call the shots. Look, he's electronic and give him the money. So he had the money in the bank. And now he's trying. Where is the cash? He's lucky. Boy, is he lucky. Because I would have whacked this guy. He's probably going to steal from them. Let's see if he does. He doesn't. But they passed the heist. I get GTA. Potential take. 1.25 million. They ended up taking 6,673. 55% cut of take. Which is 370. Elite challenge. Do not quick stop. Let me explain what happened. And uh, total cash for 70 after expenses. Uh, I, I'm not impressed. Again, I robbed a lot more money than even these games. And again, I try not to be proud of that, but it is what it is. I can't help it. But I will tell you this, people. Two things haven't changed in the year since I've been back. And I'm back now. And I'm back heavy in these games. And you, you got a suggestion? Please put it in the comment. Go to Discord. Join my Discord. And we, we have a whole uh, a page set up just for that. Give me your suggestions. If you have a stealth robbery, something that takes a little bit more brains, then shoot them up. And I'm telling you, Lester, I'm coming for you. I'm coming for you. I could definitely set up a heist a lot better. And you know what? A lot more points, a lot, however they want to do it. That was my game, people. On the real. I'm not bullshitting it. You know it. Gangster Redemption talks about all the robberies and all the money. So it's there. Check it out. Anyway, I hope you like my reviews. I'm going to be doing more of these and other games. But give me your suggestions. Join my Discord, the official Larry Lawton Discord. It's in every single video. Just look in the description. There's links for a lot of things, our Discord and books and everything we do. Have a great day, everybody. Thank you for your support. Please like, subscribe, and pass it on. It helps. Thanks, people. Have a great day. Stay safe. Make good choices.